Hey guys, welcome to Solo React Talk. Today I'm going to be reacting to Bonnie's Mind episode 2, special edition part 1 and 2, made by Ira Mighty Pirate. If you want to check out my previous reactions, my previous card will be at the top. Just click on it and be able to access them. If you want to check out the original videos as well as Ira Mighty Pirate's YouTube channel, the links are in the description below. Yes, in episode 1, uh, Bonnie. Yes, Bonnie Hanakun. Is it Hanakun? I can't pronounce the other name. <laughs> I can't remember how it's pronounced, but yes. Barney is a security guard working in the Black Mesa Research Facility. He is a disgruntled employee, I would say. Uh, he brings a lot of negative energy to the workplace. He is moody in some sort of way, if I can say that as well. Um, he doesn't want to work you know he is complaining a lot <laughs> he doesn't want to work he hates everything um, so he's very toxic I would say to the other employees in the facility whether the security guards or they are scientists um, what he does like to do is to you know shoot in the shooting range I guess that you know relieves him of stress and whatever frustrations he has and yeah, he likes shooting his pistol at the target range. And I think that's the only thing that really gives him that kind of enjoyment of his work. Uh, currently right now, he has to be fixing elevators and uh, other forms of electronic devices. Uh, some of the doctors or scientists are requesting uh, assistance in you know, repairing these things as well as the elevator. Um, I'm not sure if there's any janitors or you know electricians or IT specialists who are in the facility who can help these doctors out because it seems to me it's only the security guards and the scientists who are here you know um, so yeah let's see what happens in episode 2 special edition 3 2 1 go For it. Time to get to work. Look out, everybody. Barney Calhoun is on duty. Calhoun, okay, sorry. And he doesn't want to be. What are you doing down there? Getting a soda? I agree. Soda is a great way to start the day. <laughs> Except in your case, when the soda machine says no! Ha! Bitch, I'm the only one to get soda today. <sighs> Victory tastes all the You mean to tell me you've been having your cold drink this whole time? The soda, your soda, the whole time. Because you've been shooting in the shooting range and now you're walking around here and you're still drinking the same. Okay. Okay. The better. Everybody loves Coke. And nobody likes Pepsi. That's just, just anyway, where am I going? Honestly, I haven't drank Pepsi in years. Yeah, it's been Coke. Uh, you know when I used to drink coke like it's also been years <laughs> since I've actually drank coke yeah it's been a very very long time in fact wow I can't even remember how long but yeah it's been a very very long time like since COVID era yeah I haven't been drinking cold drink uh coke coca-cola actually for a very long time maybe Fanta orange or Fanta pineapple but nothing like coke I think I should try I don't know when am I going to get one again but yeah I'll, I'll try it out just to remember the taste <laughs> oh damn it I don't want to go to video surveillance nobody wants to go there nobody is there and I hate this elevator music you know I bet you the reason that Foxconn workers are committing suicide is because of elevator music I mean it's just right now I want to just jump out a window stuff drives you insane how? How can it drive you insane? You're supposed to be dancing to this music, not just standing still. Unless if there's other people inside, then I'll understand. But if you're alone, dance. Dance with the music. What was I talking about? Right. Coke. And Pepsi. Pepsi sucks. You don't get me started on Dr. Pepper. That guy has a PhD in crap. Hey, you want to hear a joke? 
Shouldn't you be on duty by now? Can you be on duty right now? No! Are you my mother? Well, maybe I should, but it's not your problem. Dick. I think his name really is Dick. What a funny... Why, why is Dick a nickname for Richard? I'll never get that. Dick is the nickname for Richard? I've never heard of that. Okay. Interesting. And Engelbert Humperdinck. What is up with his name? Seriously, his real name is Arnold Dossie. Why the hell would you change your name from Arnold Dossie to Engelbert Humperdinck? Show past to guard. Hey. Have a good one, Calhoun. I shall. Thank you. Oh, hey, you want to hear a joke? So, uh, <laughs> Dr. Zoidberg and uh, Hitler walk into a bar. And then Dr. I'm a little busy right now, Calhoun. Oh, come on, man. It's funny. Sheesh. <clears throat> nobody wants to hear my jokes today. Calhoun, people are working. You are not working. You're busy talking. And not getting uh, to your work designation or destination. You're not serious. <laughs> Get back to work. Man, everyone's so uptight today. Is someone pee in everybody's Cheerios this morning or something? I don't get it. Hmm. Actually, I could go for some Cheerios right now. Mm. What fluctuation? It looks like a soundboard. I don't, what is that? Hey, don't you have more important things to be doing than keeping me from my work? Uh, dude, you're not even working. You're walking around in a circle looking at this giant thing. Barney, he is working. He is observing the experiment here, you know, and keeping eyes on the gauges and other electronical uh, diagnostic stuff. Yeah, he's working. You, on the other hand, you're not working. Get back to work. Caution, fan. What is that thing? And what's with the bottomless pit? What? Uh, this has got a handrail. You thinking what I'm thinking? Yes. Oh, finally, an electrician. Okay, so they are here. Huh. Perhaps not. What's going on? All right. Did you guys break it? I bet you broke it. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Or look good. That doesn't sound right. Or smell you. good. Okay. I hope you know what you're it's doing. It's on fire! Of course. Theoretically. Theoretically, my ass. Bless you. You smell something burning. Oh, don't mind that. It's just my smoldering frustration Light. with humanity. Let's try this. Holy shit! Whoa. What the hell, guys? Is he okay? You did, I mean, you, your incompetence is astronomical. Well, what the hell do you, you have do? Idea what to do now? How did you make a keyboard blow up? Yes. There's nothing in there that's explosive. I, I just, I don't understand. Oh my goodness, this is a, ah. I'm getting out of here before someone blames this on me. Ah! Not going that way. That's management. Running away. Do 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 do. I wasn't here. Just uh. Responsible for this mess. Not me. Don't ask me. Not that Could Barney Calhoun guy. Some donuts and coffee right about now. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Donuts and coffee. Wow. Tell him what's for. Oh shit! He's coming my way. Do, do, looking nonchalant, walking away as fast as I can. Do, do, do. Running, 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 running. Hey, the what? Tram to ah. Sector G, then you're probably better off walking it. Oh. I overheard someone say that all the trams on this end of the facility are having problems. Problems? Oh, great. You know, I think the things that are broken around here outnumber the things that are fixed. Ah. Um, yeah, I guess you could say that, but it's about to get even worse. Very soon. This is just infuriating. I hate walking. You know what they get? They both BP and Toyota engineer this place? It's just... Ah! I hey, why are you hating on Toyota? <laughs> BP, uh, well... Uh, I don't really know them that well. But Toyota, come on. Their vehicles are so reliable. Just, I want to break something now. Maintenance access. I hate maintenance accesses. Ac access access ease what's the plural of access i mean it's a verb or is it a noun i don't know what am i talking about i don't care authorized personnel i am authorized to personnel e you were authorized to personnel okay i i, ah. I think i just forgot half of the english language that's okay. 
it happens to us sometimes. You did Black Mesa. You're making me stupider with your own stupidity. Yeah. High voltage. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Move it, Barrel. Ah. Oh, who turned out the lights? Um, light switch. Light switch. Excellent. Wait a minute. Uh, no. On means now. Ah, great. Another thing that's broken. Got to fix the lights. Got to fix an elevator. Got to. Ah. I don't like playing around with high voltage stuff. What do you do? Don't kill me. Ah. Oh, good. I'm not dead. That's a plus. Hey, ah! Get stupid shirt sleeve. Go over there and stay there. Bastard. Yay! Wait, if it says on, doesn't. I, ah! Let there be light! Ugh. Look at these things. They're like rusting through. It's like green stuff coming out of them. What are they? They must come from the border world, whatever is inside there. Some sort of contaminants. Not sure. About to leak toxic waste everywhere? This is just unacceptable. I mean, ugh. I just don't even want to touch you things now. If I get cancer from you guys, I'm going to be pissed. Black Mesa is going to have a lawsuit or 12 on their hands. <sighs> this is just so damned inconvenient. Why can't I have like a go-kart or a golf cart or a... I've just, you know, thought of it right now. How are you going to, you know, institute a lawsuit against the Black Mesa Research Facility? I don't think it is publicly known, you know, that this base exists and, you know, it's a, uh, a corporation that is funded by the government. I don't think anyone knows, like in public. So, you know, which jurisdiction do you go to? Uh... Who do you inform that there's this place and I used to work here? Um, is there even any records, any type of, you know, remuneration that you get from Black Mesa that is shown in your bank statements? Anything, any type of evidence to say that you worked in this place in the middle of a desert or in a mountainous area? you know, called the Black Mesa Research Facility. I think this is like a top secret place, like Area 51. So I just don't know how you're going to do it, you know, institute a, a case against them, a lawsuit. Hmm. Old fashioned computer. What the hell is this thing? What does it do? <laughs> <laughs> I better stop playing with that. Knowing my luck, I'm going to like either blow up the facility or play a game of Tetris. Ah, this water is so noisy. I can't hear myself think. Hey, wait a minute. Don't I know you? And what I think I do. Wait another minute. Why are the trams working here? I thought all the trams in this area or level or something were broken. And damn, that's a bridge. That's like the mother of all bridges. I'm officially christening you the Bridge of Doom. You're like, if Chuck Norris were a bridge, he'd be you. No. <laughs> it's too small to be a Chuck Norris bridge. No. I wonder if you could like get like a, you know, something to hang off of that thing and like slot. No, that's a bad idea. Lots of electrocuted death, I imagine. Nothing good would come from that. <sighs> I guess we'll get on with this work. I hate work. I hate stairs, too. Too. Escalators. That's the way to go. Escalators and a series of conveyors. That's how Barney gets around. Wow. Listen to that wind. I mean, where's that coming from? Is it coming down the tunnel? Yeah, I think it's some sort of air currents, you know, coming from somewhere in the tunnels. Yeah. It must be coming from that giant fan I saw earlier. They just blow it up from the bottomless pits. <sighs> tram route. Tram roads? What? Wow. Blue, red, green, yellow. Brought to you by Black Mesa Transit Authority. 
wow it's like a small city under <laughs> under this uh black mesa this mountain wow this is definitely different than uh in freeman's uh, Black Mesa Research Facility. You know, with Barney, we are seeing things totally unique and different. You know, a far more expansive environment and not just a bunker for scientists, if I can say that. This is like a livable city in a way. Huh. Red line, blue line, green line, yellow line. Yay! Brought to you by, brought to you by the Black Mesa Transit Authority. What the... They have a transit authority, but they don't have a maintenance department? I know. That's really pushy, isn't it, Trash Can? No, they do have a maintenance authority. I mean, we just saw one of them uh, trying to fix that computer. So they do exist. Maybe they're just not, you know, enough of them to go around. That's just bureaucratic bullshit. Why would you... I mean, this makes no sense. Just like this bottomless pit. What? Why'd they even excavate this? It serves no purpose. I mean, does it even have a bottom? No. I should throw my Coke can in it. Eh. Never mind, though. None of that. Oh. These must be the losers that broke the elevator. Hi, well, losers. It's about time. We no, it's not. We you people to mosey around at your own convenience. <laughs> yes, you do. Look at this guy. He's foot. <laughs> He's like, it's about time. You know, and he's just tapping it on the floor like that. <laughs> Work so we can get on with this miserable day. I'll give you that. It is a miserable day by far. So, um, what's wrong with it? You know, I, this may come out as a surprise, but I don't know a thing about fixing elevators. Is it this? It looks like a power box, but we still have power. The lights are on. So, probably not that. I mean... Um, is it something with a control panel? What floor are you trying to go to? I'll try four. That's what it is. You didn't even push the button. You have to push the button. I mean, did you got, is this your first time? You it is beyond their understanding, probably. An elevator? Jesus Christ, dudes. You're just ridiculously inept. And I thought I knew how inept the people here were, but it, whoa, hey. I didn't do it. Those materials people again. Always pushing it? their equipment too hard, dabbling in who knows what. I'd be surprised if there's one good brain among them. Yeah, you shouldn't dabble in who knows what. It's really sticky. Oh no, is the experiment happening right now? With uh, Dr. Freeman and his scientists, are they commencing that experiment to open a portal to... Uh, not sure if it was the border world or was it the alien home world. Yeah. Hmm. What is that fan light thing? Oh well. The elevator's working. Ah! That didn't sound good. Or feel good. Um. I went off. Um. Stop. 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 Um. Stop. 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 Now. Anytime now. My goodness is. Oh, not an appropriate response. This is a oh shit, what the fuck are we gonna do moment. Ah. Definitely the experiment is, has commenced and things are backfiring. Ah! What the hell is going on? Hey, Jesus! Um, okay, the elevator's exploding. I want out. And what the fuck is that? I need my gun. Die! Uh, what the hell? Bulletproof. Ah! It's like an alien! What's going on? The, what is that? What? What are those? Yeah! Look at its ass! Whatever that thing is. Walking ham. Holy shit! Oh my! Don't, uh. Whoa, okay. Ah! It's exploding! I don't want to explode! Are you dead? What's going on? I, ah! Okay, now I'm seriously scared. Places. No, J don't. Ah! Ah!
these like Patreon supporters, maybe? you go <laughs> um guys yes that was bonnie's mind uh episode two special edition part one and part two by ira mighty pirate um yes we've been continuing with bonnie calhoun as he you know continues his walkabouts within the black mesa research facility uh looking for this particular elevator that is stuck and you know the scientists needing help to fix it or to make it move and yeah you know the base itself the black mesa research facility is like 
a small little community, small little city under the mountain, uh, more so than I have seen before, like uh, especially with uh, Freeman's Mind. Where in Freeman's Mind, it looks strictly like a research facility with its nuclear or toxic waste fountains and rivers, you know, crisscrossing, going everywhere. And, you know, the place was just filled with laboratories and uh, science office rooms and, you know, dark alleys and, 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 you know, just pipes and electrical wirings and pitfalls that you don't know where is the end to it. It just keeps going down into the darkness. Uh, we saw something similar here again with Bonnie's uh, mind. Uh, but, you know, mainly we also got to see the transit system that, you know, uh, gives transportation uh, options to the scientists and everybody else within the facility. So that was quite interesting. Um, and, you know, we also got to see uh, a different person who is uh, a different person occupying a job that is not a scientist or a security guard. We saw an electrician, you know, trying to fix up the computer system uh, in one of the laboratories and it just didn't work out well over there. Uh, hope, but luckily, you know, the electrician is okay, everybody else is okay. It's just that they're in trouble now. Um, and finally, it seems like the experiment that Dr. Freeman and, and his associates were conducting has finally occurred. Uh, a calamity has struck, you know, the aliens have started their invasion and yeah, Bonnie is now in the thick of it, literally. He's in the thick of it. He just saw chaos erupt in one of the uh, the corridors where the doctor was running away uh, from one of those lightning zapping aliens. And then we also saw a tram train just crashing into the wall. Uh, exploding whatever kind of material that was inside uh you know some doctors were also being chased by some of the aliens and yeah it's just chaos it's just chaos and now the elevator that bonnie's on has snapped its um i don't know like some sort of like a security measures you know that keeps it stable has snapped and now it's descending down uh, to lower levels in the Black Mesa Research Facility. So hopefully, Bonnie is going to be okay. Uh, the other doctors that are with him, I think one of them is dead or unconscious and the other one is panicking. You know, he's in the corner crowd, you know, protecting his face. Uh, so yeah, it's just chaos now in the base. And let's hope that Bonnie can find a way to not only survive the invasion of the aliens, but of course the military. When they come by to you know clean house if i can say that yeah and we've been having a debate about you know pepsi and coca-cola <laughs> okay guys i guess that's it uh with bonnie's mind uh remember if you want to check out the original videos as well as ira mighty pirates youtube channel the links are in the description below if you like my reaction please give me a like comment and subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell if you want to be up to date with my latest videos and i'll see you guys Hopefully on Friday, you know, I'm always hoping, but you never know what happens and yeah, but it will be during this week. <laughs> it will be during this week. Okay. Bye-bye.